What's up everybody, it's your boy Kai Green K to the AK, Mr. Getting It Done. And we're gonna welcome you today to a really exciting episode of Getting It Done Under Crisis. No, I'm just kidding. Forget the crisis, we're just gonna get it done. Why? Because it's important to us to do it. And what better way to start than right now? We're gonna do a little bit of shoulders and a little bit of arms. And if you're ready, I'm not gonna bore you with a whole lot of talking. We're just gonna get with the action. Are you with me? Let's do it. Straps, get it, Ron Boy. Let's go, Kai. First exercise without further ado. I gotta warm up, y'all. I can't just get started without getting started. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna get started this way. This is how we gonna do it where I come from. Cause I'm gonna do my own thing, is that all right? And since we friends, we gonna do it together. How about that? I'm going to show you the best thing that I got to offer right now because the truth is, sometimes that's all you got. Oh, let's rock. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, Ooh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, yep, 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 all right, big boy, good job. All right, what I'm doing is I'm working on my rear delts. I'm putting a lot of blood in them rear delts and traps, rhomboids and all that good stuff. <sighs> now, when you're doing this exercise, you know what? That bench is like right in your, it's not in your chest, but it's in your solar plex. So you gotta be able to control your breathing in an effort to one, get enough oxygen to uh, do the exercise, and two, not knock yourself out by trying to hold your breath. The worst thing you could do is try to hold your breath. Always gotta breathe. All right, I like that exercise because it puts some blood where I need it. We're gonna use this gym a little bit today. Like a lot of you guys at home, I like to keep things basic, keep things simple. But sometimes I don't get a chance to use as much as much as my um, as much of my instrument as I like. So we're gonna mix things up today and get some different angles going. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Oh. Now if you didn't know when I'm doing that exercise, the money shot is what was going on in the back. Again, my rear delts, traps, and rhomboids. Now I'm gonna come back over here with just a little bit of breath. A little bit of opportunity to breathe, and we're gonna keep this going. Because it don't take long to get some good quality work done when you're serious. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, mm. now I feel that, I'm telling you my rear delts and traps are on fire, fire! They said it's like fire. 
set up in my bones. Like Jeremiah said, it won't leave me alone. I don't want to be left alone. I want to work because I got dreams. Two, three, four, back into these red delts. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Yup. Fifteen. Touch your neighbor and say the motherfucker said fifteen. I said it. I said it. Somebody called T.T. Fletcher and say, you know what? You done went and corrupted your boy Kai. Yo boy, AKA Mr. Getting It Done. Ah, we moving into the third set, y'all. Shout out to C.T. Fletcher and his family. Ah, ah. You know what, sometimes you wanna stop. Sometimes things become very, very interesting, challenging, and difficult. Even like this moment, to try to breathe. Ah. Breathe. Sometimes to catch your breath, it may take a little bit of work. Sometimes to catch your breath, you may need to concentrate. But one thing you don't want to do is stop. One thing you don't want to do is give up. One thing you don't want to do is become defeated, dejected. And the way we do that, the way we avoid doing that is by remembering why we are working. Why is it important? Why are we doing this work in the first place? I wanna have great delts. I wanna have great rear delts, great traps. These are the exercises that become the tools that help me get it. This weight in my hand becomes the tools that will help me get it. Now all I gotta do is stay focused on the goal. Are you with me? Let's do this last set. Set number three, 12 reps, let's rock. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, yeah, all right, y'all, ah, but we're not done. Don't celebrate yet, ah, don't celebrate yet, ah, don't celebrate yet. We gonna get it, we gonna get this work done. Rear delts, straps, swan boys, let's rock. One, oh, two, oh, three, oh, four, Oh, five, oh, six, seven, eight, nine, oh, ten, up, oh, eleven, up, oh, oh, twelve. Closer to failure. Closer to failure. I think that I will. I think that I will. No complaints. Mm. One. Two, three, four, change the angle. Five, six, seven, eight, change the angle. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Yeah, man, get off my back. Ow, get off my back. All right, y'all, I feel my traps and my rear delts are alive right now. They're alive. Feel it. <sighs> yep, it's in me. I'm gonna show you what to do with it. Once you got it, one, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, 
14, 15, 16, 7, 8, 19, 20. Got a secret with doing this movement isn't just to get lost. You don't want to just get lost. Every rep, every set counts. And the only way you can milk the benefit is to squeeze. You got to think about the muscles that you want to hit and squeeze. Think about what they're going to look like when you're done working and squeeze. And when the world outside is pressing in on you with their objections and shit, with questions that you may not be able to answer at the time, and you wonder, what? What can I do? Help me. I remember just to squeeze. I think about these muscles that I want to work. Two. And I squeeze, three, four, think about the shit that I want to do, six, and I squeeze, think about the things that I want to become, and I squeeze, and I squeeze, and I keep squeezing, and I keep squeezing, again, 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 and again, until I can't no more. That's 15 reps, y'all. Count them. Help! I'm gonna change this weight right here. But I'm not gonna lose my focus. I'm playing with you, but I'm serious. I'm serious about the squeeze. Mm. Squeeze. Mm. Squeeze. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. The power is in the squeeze. In the squeeze. Oh, we got one more set, y'all. We got one more set. One more set. Twelve reps, y'all. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Whoa, that's 12 reps, y'all. Count them, play it back. You don't believe me, I ain't here to cheat. I ain't here to cheat. Whoa, let's get it. Yup, yup. Four, five, six, seven, eight, yup, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. The magic, the magic is happening in my body, underneath my skin, inside of the muscles, as they contract and they work and the fuel to make it all happen is the desire in my heart. You hear me? Passion and intensity is what this body of work represents. So far, we got a lot going on. These traps, rhomboids, rear delts. Oh, I need that on my physique. That's one of those areas that I have to focus on, even in when I'm just playing around. You get me? That's how I make shit count. So a moment like having this opportunity with you, I don't waste it. I'm not wasting it. I use it to help me advance. And that's what every champion is trying to do. When you do that, when you seek the ability to do that in every situation and circumstance in your life, guess what? You do too, and we have that in common. All right, moving on. Yup, to the front. One, 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Whoa. Yeah. Okay. Okay. My shoe's untied. You see that? Now I gotta stop for that. Because I might just trip and hurt myself. My teeth are too pretty these days to allow that to possibly happen. I can't put my foot in my mouth. <laughs> my foot's too damn big. <laughs> and though I have a big mouth, these riderwares are pretty as hell, ain't they? Man, that's some awesome shit. CT, I see you. Oh, let's get to the next set. So let's go up in the weight. I'm feeling myself right now. Feeling myself. Oh, shout out to all you big delt wearing mother. No, I'm just kidding. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, Oh, 13, 14, 15, oh yeah. Yup, touch the neighbor, say 15. Oh my God, 15 is the magic number. 15, oh. Oh. somebody said you crazy if you talk to yourself. Somebody say, you crazy if you answer yourself. I'm gonna tell you right now, as you and I are talking, as friends, ain't nothing crazy about talking to yourself. Ain't nothing crazy about reminding yourself that you have someone to talk to. Wherever you are, one of the things that helps person kind of see their way through a situation sometimes is to talk aloud put things out in the clear put it on the wall put it on the board speak it into the air why it's not crazy it sounds like a person that's working to hear themselves and use the faculties that's been given to them to help them when they need it most it's not crazy to talk to yourself and it's certainly not crazy to answer yourself. One of the things that happen as a bodybuilder with training, we call and we respond. I call and I respond. I do a set, I do another rep, a whole bunch of other reps. That's the call, the response. Well, with enough rest, recuperation, and nutrition, guess what? Muscles grow. Call and response. Stimulation and the response is growth. My point, call and respond is natural. Mm. Talk to yourself. Help yourself see your way through difficult situations. Even find the ability to become a little bit more intense in the moment when it counts. Let's go, Kai. Let's get this last set. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, ooh, 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 12, oh, oh. 
A bodybuilder is able to build his physique. Why? Because he learns how to call and respond. The only way you're able to see the manifestation of anything that I've been able to do with my body and my career is because I was able to learn how to call and respond. You can't become the best in yourself unless you learn how to call and respond accordingly. Listen, man, you can't depend on somebody else to tell you when you need to be responsible and accountable with how you use the resource that is yours. That's not responsible thinking. And when you act responsibly, that means you understand that you are powerful. I can use my mind to create or I can destroy. You get me? Learning how to talk to yourself. Learning how to listen to yourself. Learning how to hear when you need help. Learning how to understand what some of the behavioral practices are that say, hey man, I'm crying out. I need to take a little bit more time with listening to me, hearing me. That stuff is real. And that is something that it's taken me a long time to really understand as vividly as I do. But because I have it, I'm able to discipline my thinking, turn off my feelings if need be, overcome the challenges of how I feel when they present the obstacles that don't allow me to see things clearly. And because I'm able to do that, I'm able to redirect my thinking to where I want it to be. You get what I'm saying? This is a thinking man's practice. Hmm. All right, y'all, we done finished that set. I'm gonna move on. I hope you're with me. Did you like what you've seen so far? We about to start arms. I tell you what, we've probably run out of time, so we'll do this again later, next time. I promise we'll do a good full five sets, full five exercises I have just for you on how we train our triceps and bicep. Um, but on that note, Take what we've talked about today, guard them closely, search them, identify some of the things that are of value to you, use them, put them to work. I swear they will service you well. And as always, until next time, let's keep it positive. Let's keep encouraging each other. Come back and see me. Peace. We're dropping pina colada, y'all. Are you ready to experience the roar of the savage? Woo!